Hey, Stephen Chandler here, Senior Pastor of Union Church, and I'm excited to bring the verse of the day. It's Matthew chapter 9, verse 37 and 38, and it reads, it says, Then he, being Jesus, said to his disciples, The harvest truly is plentiful, but the laborers are few. Therefore, pray the Lord of the harvest to send out laborers into his harvest. This passage took place as Jesus was looking over the multitudes and so he saw people, he said, man, they're weary and they're exhausted. And he had compassion for them. Talk about weary and exhausted. People today are completely, I'm overwhelmed. There's wars, there's rumors of wars, there's pandemics, there's plagues, there's gas prices. There's so much that's going on. I find so often we can be focused on the problems of the world. We can be so focused on our own problems that we miss that in the midst of problems, there's opportunity. Jesus was saying, yes, they are weary, they're exhausted, but it's an opportunity to give hope and to give freedom. We just need laborers that are willing. Now, you're going to judge me. You're going to be all right. I am anointed. I am called by God. I'm just not that bright. <laughs> I was running around the house one day. I was getting ready to head out to work, and I could not find my car keys for anything. I'm running around. I'm asking my wife, did, did you take the car keys? Where are they at? I'm checking the dog's mouth. I'm checking the kids. I could not find my car keys for anything. And then after a while, I found them, and you can guess where I found them. They were in my pocket. You know I was losing my mind that day. They were in my pocket the whole time I had the key. Think about verse 38 where Jesus said, pray the Lord of the harvest that he would send out laborers into his harvest. How many opportunities do we get to be the answer to God's prayer? We literally can be the laborers that he's looking for. If we would just say, God, here am I, use me. Here's my prayer for today. God, give me eyes to see that I'm the answer to your prayer, that I'm the laborer that can go out on my job and the school line with your neighbor or whoever it may be, and I can bring hope to those who are weary and in need of Jesus.